So guys, I said to my friends just now, we're making a really good time. Mm -hmm. In reality, we're not making good time. There are so many teams, there's so many things to talk about, there's so much fun preparation that we just have to go at lightning speed and we're not going to waste any more time because we want to go to bed tonight. Chasm, we have the Fredericton Express, our fearless leader, Commissioner Mark McRae's team at number 20. The claw. What the... <laughs> what word do you have to describe, Mark? And don't say handsome, because we already know that. Auspicious. Conducive to success, favorable. Ooh. So, fully oh, collapsed on the Holy <laughs> cow. This beer is very strong. <laughs> wow, okay. Full spit take. Oh, wow, okay. Continue, continue. I, mean, I, I thought that was just, you know, me kissing up to the commission. You couldn't handle it, but... <laughs> oh, well, I'll put some air on your chest. Continue, uh, Chasm. So, you so, did you just muggy. poison him? <laughs> <laughs> it's an excellent beer for the record. Um, so Fredericton is on the right track, and I think I think we can't argue that. And there's a lot of hope for the future there. And yeah, yeah, good work, Mark. Okay, good to know. Uh, Matthew, what do we what do we got for Mark? I think we can all agree the player that needs to be referenced is Jeremy Auger. Mm. What a beauty. Four one zero. No. Cheers. Just a beauty. <laughs> that's that's all I have to say. Eric, what Mimi got for us? Kind of had to go with good guy boss, didn't I? Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's good. That's a good trade for Pastor Nash. He's, yeah. he's a really good trade. Like yeah. 17 goals now? Yeah, he's goal again. Like, he's no. on pace for 82. Oh my goodness. Oh Pastor Nash, I'm moving. On a six um, contract. Okay, guys, we don't have any time. Normally, I do some yeah, preamble yeah. like I'm doing now or some post-amble. No time. So, guys, we have our expansion team. Now, hold the friggin' phone. Our expansion team is better than 10 other teams. We have the Seattle Grunge. The first time we've ever, ever talked about the Seattle Grunge. Because this is the first time there's ever been a Seattle Grunge. And they stole from me Greg McKegg with a leg for an arm and an arm for a leg. I'm very sad about that. Chasm. <laughs> Tell us, you better be talking about Greg McKay. Chasm, uh, what's the word with the Seattle grunge? Um, well, to Garibana. continue a theme of the evening, the word is untapped. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Love it. Of a resource not yet exploited or used. Okay. Kaz, do you think they, did they have a better roster than you imagined, before, like after the expansion draft? Like, are you impressed with their roster? Because clearly they're better than 10 other teams. I thought they'd be like near the bottom. But according to the tiers, they're, they're, they're stuck in the middle. I mean, what can you say? You draft expansion drafts differently. I took a different approach. I, I respect Phil's re approach. And yeah, I mean, anything can happen in this league. Especially in the World Conference. I mean, you can mm. go 16-0 and, oh, and so win a championship in this league. <laughs> yes. You, you may not be aware of this, Phil. Let's just hope that, that doesn't that. happen again. Yeah, mm. yeah, that's the league that shall yeah. not the, the year that shall not be uh, mentioned okay. anymore. Well, that makes sense to me. Matthew, please tell me you're going to mention Greg McKay. Well, first of all, videographer Kyle, yes, we have expansion drafts and yes, as usual, which is weird. And no, I'm not talking about Greg McKay with an arm or a leg and a leg, whatever. Fine. Uh, I am talking about, purely selfishly, Richard Panic, mm -hmm. who the grunge took from me. Thank you for oh. a <laughs> hey, 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 I would say, what was this contract Addition like? by subtraction. Oh, it doesn't matter. I said better guy. I, there are other guys with more controllers. So thank you. No panic at the disco for Matthew. Not um, a bad player. Nothing wrong with him. But thank you, Eric. What do we have meme wise for the Seattle Grunge? Oh, so this yes. is in reference to yep. some preseason woes that may actually be fortuitous. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's a good one. Yeah, injuries. Deep, deep thoughts. Injuries galore in the preseason. Why oh do we do God. a preseason? Brutal. Chemistry. Ah, chemistry. The ever I've been watching Breaking Bad a lot. Uh, ah, yes. All right. I'll, I'll trade chemistry for getting Gabriel Landis caught back. That would be just fine. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So well, good luck to Phil in his inaugural uh, season, but not too much good luck. No. Like you no. can be okay. Just don't don't be too good. Just some beginners luck. Mm -hmm. We have next up eighteen. One of my favorite GMs in the league. Terrific guy. Met him at the summit. Matt. From the Mustang. Oh, right. Not you, Matt. Oh. Different Matt. Huh. Matthew Birch. better Matt when he's not in the room. That's but. true. 
Chasm, what word do you have for Matthew's Mustangs, who are stuck in the middle? Stuck in the middle with you. Guess what we got? The word is quintessential. Mm. So of fifth spirit, representing the most perfect or typical example of a quality or class. So for Matt, you've been through it all. You've seen the highs and the lows. You've you've and you've persevered. Oh my God! All your first rounders those years ago, missing them. Uh, <laughs> As as a as a committed tanker, I don't know how you did it. <laughs> one of I will say, well, Matthew is one of my favorite trade partners. We made a couple of big trades at the summit. We may or may not be making a trade after the Weaver draft, Ooh. which might improve his goaltender situation. Oh. Um, yeah, because right now his forwards and deer are looking good, but his goaltending might need some help, and maybe he'll get someone from the Gladiators. Matthew McKinnis, what Ooh. word do you have for Matthew Ooh. Birch? I have a word. Oh, sorry, we already did the word. What's the player? I cheated here. Oh. How could you? Yeah, two players. <sighs> oh! I'm already breaking the rules. Ah. By God, he has both canes! <laughs> he has both canes? <laughs> he has both canes. I gave him one cane. You did. And then he acquired another cane. He already oh, had God. the other cane. Oh, did he? No. He Patrick came for a long time. Yeah, he had Patrick oh, came he? before he had him. Oh, yeah. Oh, I didn't realize that. So really, and I... You didn't give him a band. No, I traded him. That's right. I traded him. Yeah. Hey, be nice. Lucas, Lucas, Lucas Walmark and Demeker Sokolov are nice. <laughs> um, anyhow. I love that you have those two players Insert memorized, by the way. Jim Ross voice, by God, it's Kane. <laughs> so. Nary, Nary, has there been a better announcer in hockey or <clears throat> football or international soccer than JR in professional wrestling? Bob he Cole is, will fight you. He's the best. He beats Bob Cole. <laughs> what meme do we have? I'm interested in seeing that fight. We have Professor Farmsworth meme. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, he, he does need some goaltending. Continuing help. the preseason woes. Yes. <clears throat> All right, Matt. Well, best of luck to you in the season, buddy. As always. Now, here's something that's really weird. Calgary and Edmonton are always inexplicably like right next to each other in the power rankings. And geography. And geography and rivalry. They're always right there. So of course we have our not our fearless leader, the GM of the league, the commissioner of the league, but might as well be Mike, uh, who runs the site, who fearless does deputy. who does so much work that he yeah. doesn't brag about or tell anybody about that we really should be paying him. But we can't. We've tried. He won't accept money. He won't accept anything. Crazy. He's a saint. He's a saint. So you think we'd rate him higher than 17th. Chasm, why is Edmonton rated 17th? What's the word? The word is indefatigable. Mm. Mm. Yes. Ah. Perfect. Yes, the indie. Yes. It's showing no signs of weirdness <laughs> even after long, hard effort. Yes, and, sir. I mean, yes, sir. You, you, you took it away from me yeah. in the intro. I mean, I'm this sorry, is buddy. a guy who does everything. Yeah. Mm. And much respect and also his teams are always competitive mm -hmm. he's also won three times i believe so that's too much mike don't don't you don't need to show off so much mm. what's the player i was always it was very nice to see uh mike this summer yeah uh, this mike was awesome and he drove us around everywhere yeah we visited some breweries we did yeah things. that was fun thanks um, mike i am contractually obligated to say blake wheeler here because i've attempted to acquire him Somewhere between 74 and 79 times. Blake Wheeler is amazing. I have he failed is... <laughs> every time. Whenever, if you guys listen to the Bobcast, Bob McKenzie's podcast, which is great, he always brings up that Blake Wheeler is his favorite player. Mm -hmm. Like, just, just loves him. Like, terrific on Winnipeg. He's going to be hard to pry. Who should like... be, anyhow. Oh my God, yeah, yeah. you used to have him when you inherited the Vikings. You should oh. never have traded him. Oh, or, Any uh... chance I get to bash Mike from the Monarchs, I'll do it. You're right. Mike, that was a dumb... I can't... You know what? <laughs> Something about rock or stones and glass houses, I can't really say anyone that did a bad move. I've made a lot of bad trades. Um, including, Nicholas, we all. including Nicholas Waugh to you. Give him back. Uh, Give him back. No, I can't. Not um, as bad as Shea Weber to him. I made the finals after I traded Shea Weber. Excuse me very much. And went to game seven. And thank you. He did not win. Eric, uh, what's the meme for Edmonton? Sorry, Mike, but I feels have to say. bad, man. Yeah. Okay, that's... I'm familiar with this meme. Uh, uh, that's it's not it's an older one. It's an yeah, older meme, sir, but it still checks out. Bit, but... um, okay, that is the end of tier six. We're gonna come at you next with tier five.
the Buble. Michael Buble? Or Excellent crooner. New Super Mario Bros. From Buble. Victoria. Buble. 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 Yeah, Buble. 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 One of right. the best games ever made. Yeah, it's fun. We'll be right back. I understand what's happening right now. Bubble. Bubble. Bubble.